confusion. What's this week about? Since it's the first week of scam, we learned about uh, history of mission. Cross cultural and media cross strategy. Cross culture media strategy. <laughs> it tells us that why we're doing what we're doing. So it's a very inspiring week. I was reminded about how our job is to lay down our own our own perceptions of reality um, and consider others as better than ourselves, which is a hard thing to swallow, but I'm, I'm glad that we reviewed that before we went on to the rest of the weeks. Andrew, what did you learn this week? I learned definitely that uh, just how to communicate using a different uh, worldview rather than my own Western mindset. Is that difficult for you, Andrew? It is. It's very difficult to, to grasp sometimes where you're like, that doesn't make sense, but you realize it's because you've been dunked under the Western worldview pool and finally you're crawling onto the shore of uh, shame and honor culture and you're like, eh, the sand is hot, it burns. <laughs> kind of like that. That was a great analogy, Andrew. Thank you very much. Thank you. So yeah, Rachel, what stuck out to you this week? I think um, I learned a lot about uh, different cultures and, um, and how uh, and their religions and things. I learned a lot about um, what, what they believe in and, and their worldviews and their beliefs and things and how I could um, approach them uh, with, with the gospel and what, what would be most meaningful to them. I'm excited that this is the first week of the scam! Are you excited? <laughs> yes! We are very all excited. Yeah. I think I am inside him, whatever. <laughs>